I think the distinguish between part of my work or aspect of my work um, is the way I use color, um, the way I approach color and how I put them to the canvas. I don't think about the rules. I don't, I don't necessarily care about the rules. I just go in and I, I see what happens when I play with these colors. I don't understand it and I don't need to understand it. I just need, I just need to know what I'm doing works and I can only see it by the response of the viewer. Um, and the more I do it, the more I love it and the more I want to create more colors in different ways. Uh, and, and the thing about it is when I start, I don't know what I'm going to do. Or maybe I have an idea that I'm going to do a portrait, but I don't know how it's going to end. And that, that surprise for me is just as much as the guy that sees the painting for the first time. First of all, I, I kind of put color down on, on a canvas, um, different colors, and let the colors start playing with each other and walk around my canvas and kind of create something that it's, it's, and I get to that place that I don't understand why and how I do put these together. And then when I finish with that, it's, it's, it's my background. And then I'll put my, my face onto that with the outlines. And then I start exploring these colors and, and putting other colors with it to start shaping it and start building it out to elevate it out of this color, flat color. It kinds of, um, sometimes confuse me and, and I struggle with it but, but I think what happens is in a sense I think in any good art piece there must be struggle I always say if you get something right the first time every time somehow the soul is not there Landy uh, she's my rock <laughs> she supports me in many ways um, Yes, and I love it, but she uh, is always there for me in my career and, and, and as a family, she really um, gives her more than her part. Uh, I'm a Ray, my right brain uh, daughter, 10 years old, uh, very talented, creative, singing, painting, um, uh, into the arts and the acting, um, very sport, uh, sporty little girl, she's great in everything. Uh, we're very blessed with that. And, 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 Dylan, my, my left brain, more the intellectual one, also like very, very curious about everything and very uh, um, searching for, for answers for everything, playing chess and more intellectual kind of uh, child. But they balance each other and, and that's good for us as a family. We all, I think, we work perfectly together uh, in, our, in, in unison. So i um, very blessed with them and that helps me. I didn't have a, a, a close-knit family, it was, but mine I feel I have to I can change that I'm in the power to change that so wonderful I'm, I'm very blessed I think if you are sensitive to people and to things that happen around you um, you kind of listen um, a lot to people and how they express life and how they feel and that I think you kind of subconsciously store those feelings and emotion and then when the right time comes and you start working, you don't think about it and it just kind of explodes on the canvas. The female body and the human figure is, is, my, is my landscape. It's, it's, there's so many beautiful lines and depth and I just embrace that. It's, it's, I get lost, like people look at a, a valley or a river or a landscape. I look at a body and I said, wow, what a beautiful creation. I reflect color uh, onto the, to the canvas uh, and those reflections um, uh, manifest in other people's emotions. Um, so yes, that's just what happens, but how it works, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs>